Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It is now Thursday. I just uploaded a like collective haul yesterday and I showed where, just a second, I scored two of the dupe bog bags from Aldi. Um, they did their release for them and they were $22.99 and I was able to score one for my mom and one for myself and I was super excited about that. Um, I have a lot of stuff that I have just been storing over by my cabinet. Um, it's mostly Dollar Tree, I believe. But I need to get this stuff hauled because I'm going to start making my Mother's Day baskets and bags, whatever I come up with. And um, a lot of you know, I did a video where I went through all of my Dollar Tree stuff and things like that. And I organized it in the bins from Dollar Tree. That way... When I do something like this, like the Mother's Day baskets, I can just go through the bin and pull something. Um, so, I'll give you like an idea. This right here is all of my nails that I haul from Dollar Tree. Um, so, I have those. But like for instance, I have this bin on one of the shelves. And I love being able to just pull from it. All this is from Dollar Tree. I love to be able to just pull from these bins and make a basket or a bag. And this week is also um, Teacher Appreciation Week. So I'm going to be making little, um, probably little bags for Kansas's teachers. But I'm just going to jump right in. This is probably going to be a huge haul. I know some of you guys say you prefer, prefer, prefer <laughs> the longer hauls, but um, I'm just going to get started. Sorry if I sound a little stuffy. Uh, the weather here in Georgia, and I'm sure everywhere, is insane. Yesterday, it was almost 90 degrees. Today, it is hot again, but it rained last night. Kansas is supposed to have her last game today, so we're praying that the fields dry up. So, let's get started. Um, this is just my Sam's Cooler bag. There's nothing cooler in here that needed, or nothing that needed to be cooled, but I'm just leaving it in there. This is actually from Walmart. <clears throat> I found these, and I thought this was such a good deal. And um, they're tub treads, which are just like the little sticky things that you can stick in the tub when kids are playing. But I thought this was such a great deal, and um, I got several packs of them, and I'm just going to put them back there on my gift, gift shelf. They were originally $3.50, and all of these that I'm going to show you were marked down to $0.25. Cent. But I got the Minnie Mouse, and it says right there, $0.25, cent. and this is all the designs you get. It's great to add to a gift. I got this Minnie Mouse one, $0.25, cent. and those are the designs. Same designs, but they just have a different one in the front. Um... I got the Encanto, $0.25. Cent. Um, Baby Yoda, or Mandalorian, the child. Everybody calls him something different, <laughs> $0.25. Cent. And like I said, I will take these straight back and put them on my gift shelf. Um, this one is Lilo and Stitch. And I can see where it was $0.50, cent, and then they marked it down again to $0.25, but that's what those look like. And like I've told you previously, we have a lot of birthdays coming up, so this I had to pick these up. Um, $0.25, cent, another stitch. And then these are three more of the Encanto. That's Luisa. Uh, we have, I don't, uh, Isabella. Like I said, they're all the same designs on the inside. They just have someone different on the front, and that's the castle. So, I thought that was such a good deal. So, those will go back on my gift shelf. I'm going to put them back in the bag so I can, it's easier for me to just carry it back there. And it's good, too, because I have that huge five-tier gift shelf back there. And if I'm making a teacher gift, I have mugs and everything back there. This is more like makeup, self-care products, bath and body works products, makeup bags, um, loofahs, candy, all that type of stuff. And then back there on my gift shelf 
that's where I have like the mugs and the um, books and coloring books and kids gifts and things and then right here in this this is where i keep like all of my stuff but down here one of the bottom drawers i have like the journals and things like that so i have plenty of space for my items and plenty of places to pull from to make gifts okay i'll probably be using some of these for teachers gifts if kansas doesn't want them these are the king size kit kat and they were marked down to 60 cent at kroger and the expiration date on these, I'm not sure because they covered it with the sticker, but I'm sure they're fine. She'll probably want to keep these, but I got four of those. So I will just add these right here. Oop. Right here. I have a basket in here. You can't see it, but it, well, a little bit. It's right here. And I just keep all the candy and stuff in it. And um, I will be using tons of that candy for Mother's Day uh, baskets. And I also had this left over from Easter. And it does not expire until January of 2024. It's just the Reese's Miniatures um, Mini Robin Eggs. Kit Kat Miniatures and Reese's Eggs and Kisses. I'll probably use... The Kit Kats, the Reese's Miniatures, and the Hershey's Kisses to put in some of the um, Mother's Day bags because they don't have like bunnies or anything on them, so it'll be fine. Um, Dollar Tree. I found some of the um, Scrub Buddy sponges that everyone's hauling. It says kind of reminds them of the Scrub Daddy. I got a pack in the pink, and I got a pack in the purple. And I'm excited to use those. So this will go in the kitchen. So I'll put it back in there. Um, we love this Be Fruitful. I've hauled this a couple of times already. Um, this is great for uh, my water. I like to take one of my tumblers. I like to fill it with ice and cold water. And then I put some of the dehydrated fruit in there. Because the ingredients is this, in these are just what it says. This is just strawberries. This is just pineapple. So I love that. Um, I did go ahead and pick up two packs of the Landmark Confections Peppermint Patties. I got, I've said this in several videos, I got two of the mini peanut butter cups, two of the pecan clusters, two of the double chocolate covered peanuts. Now I have two of the, um, peppermint patties and yesterday I hauled two more of the peanut clusters. Those are my favorite. So I'll probably be keeping those for myself. But um, I got two more of those. I got myself one of these um, water bottles everyone's been hauling. It's the one that keeps you going. Um, I will probably be starting to use that with my ice and my fruit. Um, it is a um, 20 ounce tumbler and 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. ready, set, drink. Um, 9 a.m. to 3 p.m., hydrate yourself. 10 a.m. to 4 p.m., keep drinking. Um, 11 a.m. to 5 p.m., don't give up. 12 p.m. to 6 p.m., a little bit more. And 1 p.m. to 7 p.m., yay, you did it. And then it says refill. I love that. So that will go in the kitchen. And then I typically buy Kansas's little cups for her bathroom for when she's brushing her teeth from the Dollar General because I think you get like 50 or so for a dollar. I have not seen them in a long time. Um, so I just got her a little cup for now or a little pack. This has 30 and it was $1.25 from the Dollar Tree, but it's better than nothing. So I did get her those. So that will go to the kitchen. So now I have a gift shelf bag and a kitchen bag. Those are just extra. And then this is more from Walmart. I've seen people hauling the dupe candy bars. Like they have Milky Way, Snickers, Kit Kat, um, Twix. And I wanted to pick some up for us to do on our Taste Test Tuesday. Kansas is one of her favorite chocolate candies is a Kit Kat. And they have the great value milk chocolate crispy wafer bars and you get six in here and guys this was only like 248 that is insane to me that's such a good deal so this will actually i have a bag up here 
It's from Pop Shelf, and this is where I keep our Taste Test Tuesday stuff, which we still have not been able to film. Um, I did film a landmark uh, confections candy taste test in Kansas, and I did one the other day with a couple of um, things that she wanted to try. And then I saw this on clearance at Walmart. You guys know we love our little sprinkles. Um, this is the Bunny Sprinkle Mix. This was $2.98 marked down to $0.74. Cent. So I got one of those. And I'm actually just going to put all the kitchen stuff in here. So um, I'm just going to dump it out. And that can be my kitchen bag. And now I have bags. Okay, so let's move back. Guys, I try to stay, sorry about that. I try to stay as organized as I can because there is always so much. <laughs> sorry about my bending. I'm not sure if I've showed you guys this bag yet or not, but it is so pretty. I love it. I think I did, but just in case. And I did haul this one the other day in my uh, taste test with the candy. It's the butterfly bag. I said it reminded me of Jay from Frugal Jay. I love that bag. Sit it back there for a second. <coughs> this is from Salvation Army. Um, I found the Honey Pot Company Organic Regular Herbal Infused Pads with Wings. This is a 20 count. And I know that the Dollar Tree has been having these. And several of you guys have found them. I have not been able to find them at any of our Dollar Trees. I would love to be able to find be able to find them because I love this brand, but we have not. And these are pretty expensive. So I did find two packs brand new at the Salvation Army, and they had them for $2.50, which hey, it's better than full price. It's still not a dollar twenty-five, but it is better than two um full price. So I did get those. They only had two packs. Um, this is Dollar Tree. I picked up two of the, um, <clears throat> sorry guys, two of the Golden Home, uh, Ultra Thin Pizza Crust, and these don't expire until October 20th of this year. Um, we love to make our own pizzas, so I did pick up two of those. Um, I picked up another pack of the 52 Count Spoons by Everyday. So that's such a good deal. And I usually have to pack a fork or a spoon in Kansas's lunchbox every day. I found this and I'd never seen this before. This is called All Purpose Peppermint Sage All Purpose Cleaner with plant derived ingredients. And this is a 16 fluid ounce. It looks so chic. But um, I've never seen this before. And uh, it is manufactured for Rejoice International Corp. Cuts through grease and grime with a pleasant peppermint scent. It's great for use on glass, counters, tile, wood, and stone. And it works great on most non-porous surfaces. Test in an inconspicuous area first. So, I thought that was really cool. And the ingredients are great. Water. Um, there's a couple things I'm not 100% about. But castor oil, fragrance, sodium carbonate, peppermint oil, um... So, I mean, I wanted to give it a try, but I picked up two because if I like it, you guys know stuff like this goes really fast. So, and then Jay from Frugal Jay says that her family loves these. And um, these are the Stoffers or, yeah, Stoffers Animal Crackers in Chocolate. It's an 8-ounce bag. It doesn't expire until January 1st of 2024. So, I wanted to give those a try. I thought this would be good with like a... um excuse me, a dessert dip or something like that. <clears throat> and then I finally found the Charm Sprinkles Pops. You get 12 pops in here, and they're vanilla flavored with sprinkles, and they're so stinking cute. Guys, look at those. Um, I've seen everyone haul these forever, and we had not gotten them, but look, there's the actual pop. So I picked up two of those. I just thought those were so, so cute. So, I don't know if I'll use those for like end of the year party bags or just to keep in the car during the summer for when we're out and about, but I thought they were so cute. Okay, um, I went ahead and picked up one of the flags for 4th of July. I just got the one with the truck that says Land of the Free because of the Brave. I love that. So, I did pick that up. 
And then um, I needed another pack of the Modest Basics uh, Fresh Scent Feminine Cleansing Wipes. I love the packaging. It's so cute. I like to keep these in my purse with me during a certain time of the month, if you guys know what I'm talking about. And then um, I just picked up one of these little Georgia maps. I thought that was really cool. Um, trying to remember where we were at when I saw this. Oh, we were at a restaurant when we went and visited my grandparents. But it's always cool to just have a map. So... I just picked one up for us to have. That gets rid of another bag. And this bag is so stinking heavy. So this is my bag from TJ Maxx. It says, you are my sunshine. So, oh, this thing's filled to the brim. And we're at 15 minutes or a little over. Sorry about me continuing to hit the tripod. We have um, Dollar Tree. I picked up a few things for Miss Kansas for her spa. Um, I got her two packs of these umbrella picks. You get 16 in each pack. I thought those would be great for her little spa. I picked her up a pack of the paper straws, eight count. I thought those were pretty. She loves having stuff like this for her little spa. I picked her up a pack of the coasters in the pink pineapple, and you get four in there. A pack of these little plastic flower plates, and you get, I think, six. Yeah, you get six in here. That's cool, because she has all of her little tea party stuff that she uses a lot, but those are good to uh, add to it. And then I picked her up two of these um, standard essentials baskets. You get three in each. They're just cute little baskets, and um, I like the size of them. So I picked her up two of those to help her keep stuff organized for her spa like her, she can put like her um like if she's used because i get her a tray for when she's doing pedicures and manicures she can sit one of those little baskets on there with the um like color of nail polish that the person chooses and she can just stick it in a little basket so it doesn't roll all over the tray um i got some more of these lip smackers i've been hauling these were only 25 cent this time uh, and this is in the super fruit, so I picked up two of those. I thought these were really cute for the 4th of July. It's just 12 tinsel food picks, so I picked up one of those. And then I picked up these Warhead Cubes. This is a 5-ounce bag. That's a really big bag because normally they're like 3.5, so I'll add that to um, my candy dish or basket over there that I just showed you guys. I hope you guys are having a great week. This week is flying by. These are on clearance at Kroger as well. They are one-step tie-dye kits and there's 10 pieces in here and this one is pink and purple and it's princess and these were all marked down to 54 cent. So one project guide, two one step dye bottles, two plastic gloves, and five rubber bands. So all you need is whatever you're tie dyeing. So it's really cool. So this one, like I said, is pink and purple and princess. Um, this one is also pink and purple and princess. That way Kansas can do one and I can do one. And then I got both of us a teal and green and neon. And like I said, they were all marked down to 54 cents. So got those. And I know someone put in one of my comments one time, like, cool haul, but what do you do with all that stuff? I promise you, everything I buy has a purpose. So whether I'm gifting it, sharing it, passing it along, using it for a gift, or restocking something in my home, putting away for a future um, gift, I promise it has a purpose. I know sometimes it probably looks like I just buy stuff to buy it. I've really tried to rein back on that. And there are so many times where I walk into the Dollar Tree or any store and come out empty-handed. Um, so, and what some people probably don't realize is this stuff has been sitting here. So, there's multiple times that I have one bag I just add to it. I might add three bags to this. I might add two bags to this. And it builds up over time. So, when I do a haul, it looks like I'm like crazy with 500,000 things. But it's not all from one trip and it's not from one day. So, I just wanted to kind of put that out there. Um, these are so beautiful. 
And I had to pick these up when I saw them because um, you can, if you keep your receipt, you can always come back and blow them up later. And I have my receipts. So I got three of each design for my mom, my sister, and myself. I just thought it would be something super cute for Mother's Day. And these were, they had so many beautiful balloons, but these were my three favorites. So here's my receipt for these. And like I said, if you keep your receipt with the balloons you purchased and put it in your bag, they will blow them up for free when you bring them back. So the first one I picked out was this one, and it just says, Happy Mother's Day. So it looks like a basket of um, flowers. I thought these were so beautiful, so I picked up three of those. Actually, I think my mom bought three and I bought three. So, <laughs> so I'm going to put that receipt right back in there or I will misplace it and then I'll be so upset. So I'm trying to get all this Mother's Day stuff together because I don't want it to be here and then be forgotten about. Um, and then this is the other one. Those are the ones my mom picked up. These are the ones I picked up. Here's my receipt for mine. And you guys know I had to get these. These are so beautiful. It says, Happy Mother's Day. It's a big sunflower. It says, Kind, Caring, Fabulous, uh, Powerful, Beautiful, Strong, Love You, and Best Mom in the petals of the sunflower. And in the middle, it just says, Happy Mother's Day. But once again, I, um, I got three like my mom did for myself, for my mom, my sister, and myself. So I'm going to stick my receipt back in there. Because I would be so sad if I had those and lost the receipt because then I would have to go somewhere like um, Party City. And they are not cheap when you bring in balloons to inflate if you did not purchase from them. They're not cheap anyways, even if you do purchase balloons from them. Um, here's some more of the Lip Smackers. These ones were 50 cents and they are in the grapefruit. You cannot beat that. So when I saw them, I picked them up because these are great to keep in your pool bag, beach bag, because these do have, um, SPF 30 in them. And it's Kiss Therapy, clinically proven moisture locking formula with coconut and jojoba oils. Citrus antioxidants to help protect lips against free radicals and visi visibly healthier looking lips. And then the super fruit has clinically proven moisture locking formula with, they're both coconut and jojoba oil. So it just has a little bit of a different flavor. So um, I was really excited about this stuff. Um, I picked Kansas and I up these matching um, spa headbands is by Be Pure, and there's the mommy and the child size, so I got us those. That way, she can actually, if she wants to, she can use these in her spa. That way, like my friend Katie and her daughter Kylie come a lot, so Katie and Kylie can use it, and then if my sister and my niece Bella come, they can use it. If my mom comes, she can use it, and these are washable and reusable, so that's really good, so I'll actually let Kansas have those for her spa. And then I got this for her. It's the microfiber hair wrap because she always needs hair wraps um, because you guys know her hair uh, is so long, so thick. So when we wash her hair, I have to towel dry it really well. And then I wrap it in one of these microfiber uh, towel wraps and I let it sit for like an hour and then I try to blow dry it because if not, it'll take me like eight years. <laughs> And I also got this to go with it. It's the detangling comb with shower handle. I thought that was so stinking cute. So I'm going to put this in the comb, in the comb, in the shower because she needs a new one anyways. And then I got this eye brush set with case. There's four pieces, uh, four brushes in there. I know you guys have probably seen some of this stuff, but I thought that was really cool. Um, Kansas. Well, no, I picked these up at um, Ollie's for $1.99. They're just hemp seed oil infused exfoliating bath poofs, and it's a three count. And guys, these are only $1.99. That's a great deal, so I picked those up. And as you can see, we've already used one. This is more Dollar Tree. All Everything I've been hauling has, was Dollar Tree, except those uh, tie-dye kits and the poofs. Um, I got the little 4th of July gnomes. I just got one of each. They're so stinking cute. 
Um, cause I don't go all out for 4th of July, but I do decorate. So, and then I picked up the bead garlands. So I got this one with the tassel and the American flag. And then I picked up this one with the tassel and it says USA, sorry. The little map. So that's what I got. I'm just going to keep that stuff in here. And I'll put my flag in there. So look at us. Now we have a 4th of July bag. Um, I picked up these. Goodness, some of this stuff is old. <laughs> these are the Kendall and Kylie backpacks. I got one in the butterfly. I got one in the, um, check. That reminds me of Vans. And then I got one in the Anchors. So those are so stinking cute. I will add those to this cabinet. Ow, that was my finger. If you guys can see that blue basket, that's where I keep all those types of little bags, makeup cases, and all those. Um, I got another. I've hauled so many of these, guys. These are those Layer 8 hats that were originally $20. I bought so many of these for resale, and I did really well on them. And then I got Andrew and Mikey one, and now I have an extra one that I'm probably going to give my nephew for his birthday that's coming up on May 23rd. I found the Golly Super Green Gummies, the 30 count. Um, I take these every day, and um, some people say they're disgusting. I've kind of grown immune to the taste, so they don't taste bad to me at all. These expire on June of 2023, but they will go past the expiration date. But I did pick up three of them at the Dollar Tree for $1.25. So, I'm going to add those to my food thing because I have a basket in there where I keep my apple cider vinegar ones, those, and the vitamin C ones. So, picked up this uh, travel bottle by, three-piece travel bottle set by April Bath and Shower. I'd originally gotten that for Kansas's little spring break vacation, but she actually just wanted to take her bigger bottles and put them in the shower. That way, she didn't get confused. And I was like, well, I can write an S for shampoo, a C for conditioner, and a B for body wash. She was like, no, that's okay. So, I'll just put this up um, in our, probably down here, one of these little baskets for next time we go on vacation. You can't go wrong with that. And I also got a black set of those brushes. So, I'm thinking about using these for Mother's Day because I don't need any more brushes. So, I'll just add those to the Mother's Day tote. I picked up more of these um, faux nails by Pretty Women. I've hauled some in the past, but this time I got that like matte blue set. I love this for the fall. It's like that burgundy and it's got a couple of the little glittery mauve ones. This pink is so pretty. And then I got these that look kind of rainbow. Those would have been pretty for Easter, but I had mine done already. So I'm actually going to take these and go ahead and stick them right here in my nail bag. This is one of those big bags from the Dollar Tree that you can buy. Okay, I got this on clearance for $5. And what's funny, you guys, is look at the brand. The brand is Layer 8, which is the same brand as this hat right here. And this was from TJ Maxx. This retailed for $24. I'm not sure... I'm going to see if I can peel it to see what TJ Maxx was selling it for. I got it on clearance for $5, but trying to without. It says compared at $13, but I don't think I'm going to be able to get the tag off, and I don't want to spend too much. No, I'm not going to worry about it, but I got it for $5. It was originally $24. And it's the one that has, like, the fleece on the inside. Me and Kansas share hats, so I thought that was super cute. So, I got that. Picked up a pack of this Check Mix in the White Cheddar. This is a pretty big bag. This is an 8.75 ounce bag. And this does not expire until October 8th of 2023. Um, <clears throat> these were what I was looking for, because these are what I'm using for Mother's Day. 
These are the Freeman Sleepy Time Four Piece Mask Kit. It says dream big for restless skin and mind. You have an overnight whipped eye mask, overnight whipped face mask, a satin-like sleep mask, and a night in mask duo face mask and treatment. And these are heavy, you guys. So I was super excited to find those. That's such a great deal. I think I only got five, but I picked up five of those because I have a lot of gift baskets to make. So I'm gonna add those to that. I picked up a few of the um, garden flags for spring. I got this one that says blessed. And I got this one that says welcome known. Because I have flags at different areas of my yard. We have a flagpole out in the back by Kansas's um, um, play set. It's like a huge swing set with a canopy and it has a little place underneath where you can have a picnic. We have one in the front by our steps. We have one in the back by our steps. So it's always good to have a few extra. Um, Mr. St. Patrick's Gnome over here. See, that's what I'm talking about. I get myself in trouble when I just pile stuff up. But it's okay. He's not going to go to waste. He is non-perishable. So I'll just put this up for next year. She is so cute. Look at her braids. So I got that. Um, I found these, which was really cool. I'm going to pass these along probably to my grandfather. These are the Centrum Men 50 Plus Multi Gummies. Supports heart, brain, eye health, and muscle strength. You get 38 gummies. And these do not expire until July of 2023. So I picked up two of those. Oh, I got two gnomes. I got her. I got her boyfriend. Woo -woo. So I'll put those in my... St. Patrick's tote, and they'll be just fine. Picked up two packs of this for Kansas' spa. This is the um, Amaray Premium Natural Epsom Salt Bath Crystals Foot Soap. Relieves tired feet, and it's eucalyptus scented. Magnesium sulfate soaking solution. Soothes aches and pains, rejuvenates and restores, and removes toxins. This is a 16-ounce bag, and it is resealable. And I love that it's the foot soak because she does do her little pedicures. She, Y'all, her spa is so cute. I wish you guys could book an appointment with her and come. She is so cute in everything that she does back there. I just, I love it. Um, Did I already haul some of this? No, I didn't. Okay. This is the Amy Naturally Kind Glow and Bright Illuminating Face Mask. It says, with rose water and hibiscus, brightens and hydrates, instant dewy complexion, dermatologist approved, formulated for dull, lackluster skin, including sensitive skin. And these are a 3.3 ounce bottle. And this Amy brand stuff is good and it is expensive. So to find it for $1.25, and those will be going in Mother's Day baskets. I'm going to have to pull this up here. Um, we use these little vases all around our house. I have one on one of those floating shelves on the wall. Um, I have one uh, on by the wall, but it's on my little butterfly table. With I have like one of those um, little organizing things that have the truck on it. And I have a book on there and this on it with some greenery. But I got two of those in the iridescent. So I'm going to give one to Kansas for her spa, and then I'll probably find something else to do with the other one. I could put one in a Mother's Day basket. Um, I got two packs of the bunch of, okay, two packs of the bunch of crunch to add to my Mother's Day baskets. These are good until October 28th of 2023. Um, I threw those. We're always needing these. These are the Bell ponytail holders. You get 12 pieces. So, Kansas is always needing those. Um, I have these. I've hauled some in the past. These are great to add to Mother's Day baskets. I have one clip to Kansas's ball bag. I have one clip to my bag that I take to the field. I'm probably going to keep one in my bog bag, dupe, dupe bog bag that I bought. These are great to have. They're just the um, hash tag ash tag 20 piece bandages and they just come in a i know you guys have seen these by now but just for somebody in case um they're so cute they just come in this little plastic clip or sorry y'all 
plastic container and then it has a clip so you can clip it to anything and it's cool because it's a heavy plastic you can refill that so i thought that would be kind of cool to add to the little mother's day baskets as well so uh let's see i have these um april bath and shower spa headbands i got one in the light pink with polka dots this is definitely going to miss kansas it's the leopard print and then i got one in the dark pink with polka dots and i love them because they have the big bow on the front um, my dad got me this off he won this off of one of the bid it sites that we all do but guys look at that he said he saw it and thought of me and i thought that was so sweet it's just a little mug with a gnome that's wearing a hat so you can keep your coffee warm. I can put this on my um, coffee bar year round. So I just thought that was so sweet and thoughtful of him. I got two packs of the Albanese um, mini gummy butterflies. Those will be great for Mother's Day gift baskets. And these are good until July 15th of 2024. I was excited about this. This is the Be Pure Tinted Rose Oil Lip Balm. Go from clear to your unique color. And I actually want to try one of those on for you guys to see how it does. I got Kansas this Jot Retractable Eraser. And it comes with two extra. That's great for her to keep in her pencil um, thing at school. And bag's empty and we are done after this i'm gonna try that on for you i got one of the uh derma seal oil free daily facial creams with vitamin e uh two fluid ounce i use this as i use the day and night cream but i was running low on my day cream so i wanted to replace it and then i got these they are the chapstick total hydration moisture plus tint and it says hydrates and protects and it has Natural sunscreen, broad spectrum, SPF 15, and this is pretty in pink. Those will be going in Mother's Day baskets. I got one of the Salt Range Himalayan Pink Salt Nasal Inhalers. These are a godsend. These work amazing. And the last thing in this haul, I believe, maybe, is this Chapstick Total Hydration. Uh, it's a overnight lip renewal treatment it says uses the restorative powers of the seat to nourish lips deeply conditions and rejuvenates lips for the coming day so i wanted to get one of those to try i thought that was really cool okay let's give this a try so what's your shade it says you can be a lighter mauve a darker darker mauve or the dark so we're going to give it a try i like doing stuff like this just to see because everyone's pigmentation is different whether it be your face your skin your lips just like um two people can use the same perfume and it smells completely different so that's cool packaging too that's what it looks like so it goes on clear so this is the color of my lips let's see what we have it smells like rose I think mine's just going to be the lighter mauve. Yeah. I like that. That is so cool. I, I got two. I may give this other one to my mom. So, something I did want to show you guys. Y'all know we do the, um, the Amazon bins where... No matter what it is, you only pay. Guys, we're going on 40 minutes. It's going to take 10 years for this video to upload. Um, I found this in there for a dollar because it starts at $8 on Friday. And it's $8 Saturday. They're closed on Sunday. Monday, it's 7 Tuesday, it's... I can't remember if it's 6 I think it drops down to 5 Wednesday is two and thursday is a dollar and then friday it starts back with new stuff but guys look at this for a dollar i'm using some of these in the mother's day bags that's what i wanted to show you i got all of these for a dollar 
they're brand new with the tags but look so it come with one two three four four of those bead garlands for a dollar i was so happy about that i'm definitely going to keep one or two for myself um and then i'll probably drape one over my mom's bog bag so got those and um i think i'm going to stop there there's a lot more i want to show you but this video is so long Thank you guys for hanging out with me. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you saw something that you haven't seen. And if you did, thank you for still hanging out with me. And until next time, stay blessed, you guys. Bye.